proposed increases in school bus fares and school meals got the green light from a Board of Education committee today. The approvals come as the BOE struggles to deal with a $16 million budget cut this fiscal year. And as KITV4's Jody Leong tells us, the board is looking at the possibility of additional cuts in the next few years. The Board of Education is looking at raising the prices of school meals and school bus fares again. The BOE Committee on Finance passed a proposal that would increase one-way school bus fares from $0.75 cents to $1.25. The current fare increased in January of 2010 after remaining at $0.35 cents since January of 2004. Under the plan, an annual pass would increase from the current $225 to $270 a school year. Testimony was clearly against a fair hike. When you increase the fares, ridership falls. But I'm still Parents struggling. can't afford it. I mean, one child is one thing, but when you have two or three children in school, times are getting desperate for the safe transportation of our public school students. The committee also approved a proposal to raise the price of most school meals. Lunch prices at middle and high schools would increase from $2.35 to $2.50. Elementary school prices would drop from $2.35 to $2.25. The BOE is exploring the proposals as it digests the possibility of more budget cuts. The Abercrombie administration is asking all state agencies to prioritize their resources and prepare for a 5% budget cut. For the DOE, that would mean $66 million. We're now getting into the way the student formula, which gets into teachers in the classrooms. So it's going to be a challenge. I don't want to alarm the public that that's what the administration really is asking us to do. Jody Leon, KITV4 News. The deputy director of the Department of Budget and Finance says this is a process and the administration has not made any decisions on the $50 million that must be cut from the budget in each of the fiscal years 2012 and 2013.